Hi folks, in this video I'm going to be waterproofing my French Army F2 tent with the Nick Wax product. I'm not an ambassador for Nick Wax, I'm not sponsored by them, but I use their products because I find they're the best around for waterproofing your tent. French Army F2 tent with Nick Wax tent and gear, a solar proof concentrate. Now you've got to mix this with um, 350 mils of water and it says mix well. So I did that in this pot and transferred it into a nice spray bottle. I then sprayed it on my tent and wiped off the excess with a damp cloth, sorry for the noise, the street's quite busy. I've then um, recycled the damp cloth by wringing it out, back into the bucket and topping this back up um, with the excess and as you can see quite a bit to come back off the cloth as well. Point of note, do it with gloves because my hands are sticky as hell, I've washed them four times and I still feel like my hands are waterproofed. Um, very, very waxy. Obviously this is drying out, you've got to leave it to dry out and obviously once it's dry it'll be fully waterproofed. So the Nick Wax product I'm using is the Nick Wax Tent and Gear Solar Proof Concentrated Refill. It's a high performance concentrated waterproofer, it adds UV protection and can double the effective life of your tent and look after the material that it's made out of. You pour the Nick Wax concentrate into a container and add 350 mils of water and mix well. You spray brush or sponge under every part of the fabric and you remove the surplus product with a damp cloth. I then considered doing um, some homemade seam seal. Silicone. For this you have to have 100% silicone carbon and you mix it with turpentine, not organic turpentine, otherwise the chemical reaction for the turps to break down the silicone into a paste which is spreadable um, over your seams will not occur and it will all coagulate. Then you spread it onto your seams in an even thin layer and leave to dry. If you have a tent with an out uh, fly sheet to turn it inside out and put the seam seal on the inside out bit that way you'll keep the aesthetics and it'll look okay. For me I didn't really mind. Seam seal on there. I know it's on the outside but I don't really care as long as you walk through. The tent is cheap enough. Waterproofing and seam sealing for the West Island way. Yes, the seam seal is on the outside because it's a French Army F2 tent, the cheap, about forty pounds on eBay, and it, I'm not wanting aesthetics. I want to be dry, even though I'll probably get wet in the Highlands. To be fair.
as you can see the silicon turpentine mix does mark your material by leaving a rubbery dark line on the seams if you don't want that turn your fly sheet inside out if you have a fly sheet or seam seal from the inside of the tent if you want your aesthetics to remain the same Hope you've enjoyed this review and thanks for watching.